redefining a clean workplace environment after COVID-19. The COVID-19 pandemic has brought about noticeable changes to many things, particularly in how cleanliness is defined. Hand soap, hand sanitizer, and disinfectant wipes became one of the must-haves to combat the virus. As businesses consider how to transition their employees back to the workplace, they become more transparent and proactive in cleaning, disinfecting, and sanitizing. Understanding the difference between cleaning, disinfecting, and sanitizing. Cleaning, disinfecting, and sanitizing do not refer to the same thing. Cleaning physically removes dirt, germs, and impurities from objects or surfaces with water and detergent. Cleaning does not necessarily kill bacteria but helps reduce their numbers and the risk of infection. Disinfecting uses chemicals, such as EPA-registered disinfectants to kill germs or bacteria on surfaces. Disinfecting does not necessarily clean filthy surfaces or physically remove germs. Sanitizing reduces the numbers of germs or bacteria on objects and surfaces to a safe level, as judged by public health standards. Sanitizing can be done by either cleaning or disinfecting, or both. Implementing an effective disinfection strategy. First, employers need to consider where to disinfect. Generally, the more people touch a surface, the higher the risk of infection. Prioritize disinfecting high-touch surfaces, such as doorknobs, tables, keyboards, toilets, sinks, faucets, phones and elevator buttons. Second, they need to consider the cleaning and disinfection frequency. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention recommend regular cleaning at least once a day. If certain conditions apply, they may choose to disinfect after cleaning. Disinfection may also be more frequent depending on certain conditions, including the following. High COVID-19 transmission in the community. A low number of people wearing a mask. Unaccustomed hand hygiene. Space is occupied by people at a higher risk of developing severe symptoms due to COVID-19. Moreover, they should consider the availability of cleaning products and equipment and provide PPE for the cleaning staff. If the company have no trained cleaning staff or require in-depth cleaning and disinfecting, they can engage with professional office cleaning services. The emergence of antimicrobial technologies for foolproof protection. Beyond ordinary disinfection and cleaning, businesses are beginning to approach a new disinfection method, antimicrobial technology. The term antimicrobial indicates the function or property of a material that can prevent or kill the growth of microorganisms. Current antimicrobial technologies applied in fabrics and surfaces have proved to be long-lasting and effective against bacteria. However, more testing is required to prove its capacity to inhibit or fight viruses. The best way to minimize the risk of COVID-19 infection remains to be cleaning and disinfection of all high-touch surfaces and high-traffic areas, as well as regular hand washing.